this is how you are going to know that you met the one God had installed for you all this while. Okay, I just had to put this message out there because I felt it deep in my spirit. I will give you three examples, okay, how you can tell that this is the one the Lord had installed for you. Shalom, the Lord graciously bless you. I welcome you in the mighty name of Jesus. If this is your first time coming across our amazing channel, you are welcome. This is Revealing God's Word with Judith Gaines, and I am happy to have you here. Please join our amazing family by hitting the subscribe button okay this message is specific and you have to pay keen attention it will re resonate with you if it is meant for you hallelujah let us pray father i give you the glory i celebrate your holy name i pray as your children are here today believing you for signs believing you for clarity believing you for confirmation may you show them the right path may they receive the spirit of discernment in the mighty name of jesus the very first aspect I want to elaborate on is um, conversation, communication, and conversation. If you want to know, okay, this is how you will know this person is for you. The very first sign you will receive is communication. God will not want you to be with a man that you cannot com communicate with. I can bet you there are a lot of people in relationships, in marriages, in marriages and relationships, it's okay, baby, in marriages and relationships that, sorry about that, with a man they cannot communicate with. A lot of people are in, in situations like that. The very first important thing is you want to be able to communicate to this person. You want to be able to talk to this person. You want to be able to, you know, express yourself to this person. Okay. And the second thing I was at, I received in my spirit and I said I was going to elaborate on, excuse the dis distraction, is attraction. And you'll, you'll be sitting in there and go, of course, I have to be attracted to my partner. Yes, it is very important to be attracted to your partner, okay? Don't just dive into that relationship or that marriage proposal because you are just trying to get it out of the way because you have been having a lot of peer pressure of when you are going to marry because you feel like your age is catching up with you and you want to get married quickly. And remember, remember, there is nothing as age in the, in the timeline of God when it comes to marriage, okay? Don't even let that be part of a decision you're making when it comes to getting married. And the next thing I was going to talk about is shared value. Look at this person, talk to this person, and see if you guys share similar values in life. Is this person somebody that you can grow in faith with? Is this person somebody that you can build a future with? Is this person someone that you think you can raise your kids with? Check out those shared values with this person. These are the three main signs that you will know that this is the right person that God has sent your way. But then again, you have to be aware, okay? That you have to be aware. The enemy can send counterfeits with the same values that you are looking for, with the same, you know, um, characteristics that I just mentioned to throw you off. That is why I say, when you receive all this confirmation, go to the presence of the Lord and pray and say, Father, if this is your will for me, let it be done. But if it is not your will, let it be exposed. It is very important. That is a very powerful prayer point. And then you give yourself time. If it is not the will of God, you see, it is going to start unraveling itself it's going to start revealing itself okay the lord bless you keep you because it's awesome countenance to shine on you always remain blessed and please be prayerful i'll see you next time bye bye